plan was simple. Reach the highest peak in Kentucky, Virginia, Tennessee, Georgia, and the Carolinas. PJ, Steph, and I would rendezvous with Josh in the misty town of Black Mountain, North Carolina. From there, we would set off on one of our most exhilarating adventures yet. But it wouldn't be easy. Our journey promised treacherous trails, unpredictable weather, and very long car rides. In the end, somehow we mostly pulled through. I've made it my personal goal to climb the highest peak in the contiguous 48 states. The Appalachia has always had some sort of draw to me. I'm fascinated by the culture, as well as the stunning landscapes the mountain range has to offer. These videos take a lot of coordination and planning to make, so I really hope you appreciate the ride. Without further ado, I present to you our first voyage, Sassafras Mountain, South Carolina. PJ? What you got there? Steph? Scully? Are you a milkman? Yeah, I'm, I gotta finish my milk because we're leaving. Are you excited, Steph? I'm very excited. I think they're on to me. Welcome to the jungle. Yes. After a grueling 12 hour drive to our motel, we all collectively agreed that a late night Pizza Hut run was in order. The local first responders celebrated our arrival. It's going like 10 miles an hour. Do you think we'll see any cryptids? No. Darn it. I'm looking forward to some gnomes with Volkswagen Beetles. God, I hope so. What do we got there, Steven? Pizza! So we do not have any plates here in the car. Whoa. Does that make you happy or sad, Sev? Next morning would demand yet another long drive to our first destination. Named after the abundance of sassafras trees crowding the ridge, Sassafras Mountain sits directly on the North and South Carolina border. At 3,552 feet, it has one of the most breathtaking views in either state. We're going to church on a beautiful, rainy, sunny Sunday morning. And, uh, you know, with Josh, we're not going to hit this guy even though he's not looking. I don't know why they put that mountain right on the border. Yeah, I feel like it's like not very good planning, if you ask me. bananas are stiff today. Why are they uh, stiff today? Because they're still in the ripening process, like they're not perfect yet, which is great because this is the first full day. And I got like 10 more bananas to go through. How he loves firm bananas this morning. I do love firm bananas. Oh, Josh also is a big fan of firm bananas. Yeah. I'll eat mushy ones, but like. Will you eat brown bananas? I would use. I used to just sort of power through it, but recently I've decided I don't care a whole lot, and I will just if if it's like really brown at the end, I will just eat it down to like that point and just throw the rest away. It really? You don't like that it's sweeter? It's not. It oh, brown bananas are totally. No. Oh totally no. Wait. Are you talking about brown peeled bananas or like brown, brown on brown, the banana? Brown on the banana. Okay. Well. So yeah. That, that's definitely not sweeter. Are you excited to climb Sassafras? Are we climbing Sassafras? Or we're, we're, driving? Up, we're driving up Sassafras. Are you excited to drive home? I am excited to do whatever we need to do to Sassafras to... Uh, By whatever means necessary. <laughs> whatever. It's a Sassafras I will go on all fours like Stephen Harper's ancestors would want me to. Steph, are you excited? <laughs> yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. Oh, number one. Yeah. Oh, number one.
right, here we go, guys. We did it. We're going home. Finally, after traversing the winding path up the mountain, we had reached the summit. It was one of the best views I had seen in a long, long time. Ba -ba -ba. So peaceful. Oh god, I didn't know we'd be doing hiking today, guys. Oh my gosh, so much. Oh god. I heard raspberry, blackberry, blueberry. What is like the archetypical berry, you know? Like what is the original berry? Strawberries for sure. But it would just what like what is the berry just called berry, you know? Is there just an archetypical berry, you know? berry? This is just a jump at that point. Oh. This calculation. Oh. Come on, Josh. You can do it. Oh. All right. There we go. Now we have a clear border of North and South Carolina. Now, this is weird. It bends here. So, North Carolina is actually over there, but this is technically South Carolina. Dude, I'm higher up than you. No, I'm higher. No, I'm higher. <laughs> I'm higher. You know what this makes me think of? Minecraft, when like I first had Minecraft and you could send the render distance really far, and it just feels like wow, it just goes on forever and ever. Yeah, that's fair. Things get tend to get pretty quiet around the top of a mountain, you know. Of how like accurate Minecraft is, like from a distance. We're, like trying to reach each other. Josh, do you think you could do push-ups in both states, like one hand on the other? Push-up in two states at once. I was thinking like. Like what? Yeah, I mean, I, I mean, I go on this side if you guys are still wanting to do it. Oh, I think that actually, that's actually a weather station, I think. Not a flame. <laughs> Poke what? Poke what? The radio tower? Yeah, you don't want to go. That size point. I think, uh, I don't know. I mean, I could get zoinked, you know? Well, it's different down here. You see a lot of big difference down here, don't you? A big difference down here, man. 
Yeah, well, they will burn around, is it not? That's funny, even just the buildings are different because you don't need oh, to yeah. accommodate like right. two feet of snow on your roof. People so. are more talkative, I've noticed. Yeah, like, people so are more willing to talk to me. You get to meet different variety of people being around different people, different sorts of stuff. I kind of like that. Yeah, it's it funny too, we went to. It's also like 30 degrees back home right now. 30? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it was, I think, 31 when we left in the morning. And then we got out of our car and it was in the 70s down here. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I can work with that. I know, mean, that's right. Like, uh, PJ, that message a lot, message. what did you think of the peak? I enjoyed it quite thoroughly. You know, I think it would have been fun to hike, but I am A-OK -okay that we drove it because we were able to have a nice relaxed Sunday, good day of rest. We got to just sort of chill out at the peak as opposed to being like, yeah. What did you think of this peak? Uh, good view. The drive was fun. Mm -hmm. Had some close calls. Yeah. Cool. What did you think of this peak? I thought it was fun. It's fun that it's on the border. I was not. I did not know that. A lot of the high peaks are on borders. It's yeah. funny that this is the highest peak of South Carolina at the border. Not, not the, the highest peak of North Carolina. That would have been quite convenient if we could have done the peak at one. Like, all right, I did South Carolina. <laughs> it's kind of weird that they put a mountain on the border, though. Yeah, I don't know why they do that. Yeah, I just, I don't understand why they just put mountains on borders. I mean... Well, imagine if there was, like, a map, like, North Carolina and South Carolina, like, they were at war together and, like, fought a battle here. Uh, oh, so, really North weird. and South Carolina war. They fight a battle on top of the mountain. They have, like... One governor on one side and the other governor on the other, and they both duel to the death. They're just like, the winner gets complete control of the entire mountain. North and South Carolina can just be Carolina. This mountain is ours, we need to fight to conquer. That one is where the enemy camp is, so they might be where they are going to Oh, finally, a room of rest. Oh, God! That wasn't a very good rest. At sunset, it was time to say goodbye to Sassafras. While I wish we had hiked this peak, the scenery still made the drive worth it. But don't worry, we still have many adventures ahead. So now it is sopping wet. It is uh, raining really hard. David, is the uh, water soaked through the jacket? Um, probably. Oh my god, guys! Look! Oh. 